We just arrived in Pattaya city tonight and I will show you in this video our private pool villa that we are renting on the Airbnb and after that we are going to go for dinner at one of the best local place in Pattaya that famous for the local and expat as well as the tourists because they said that the food is really good so I'm curious what do they have and the only way to find out to go together let's go Hi, good evening everyone. Welcome back to our DNS travel course. Thank you so much for coming by and we'll watch our vlog until the end tonight. So we just arrived to our private pool villa in Pattaya city. So this house has like four rooms. So all the four rooms only at the ground floor and then everything is on the top floor, uh, second floor and the top. So uh, let me show you real quick about our uh, bathroom here and as well as the room. So you got the uh, bathroom, like the shower room and the toilet and everything in the same bedroom. It's kind of like the open uh, style. Uh, unfortunately, they don't have the uh, curtain and the wall. So you guys need to do like a little bit like, um, I don't know if it's uh, comfortable for sharing everything together. But if you got a couple, it's fine. But if like the family, like the kid, and with my sister here, they kind of like a little bit inconvenient for that. So the solution is if anyone want to do something like in the toilet, you know what I mean, right? Um, they need to get out and let the person do the business. <laughs> so this is the only thing that we kind of like a little bit disappointed, but um, the rest is fine. Like here at the kitchen area, you guys can see um, the owner try to show us how to use the stuff um, inside the kitchen like the burner she uh, just make sure that we know how to use everything in the house so this house we pay around 140 or 150 US dollar if you calculate from the um, local currency and they don't have breakfast for us but um, they do have everything in the kitchen for you to cook like your own home so feel comfortable everything because our family like to cook or buy the food from outside and then we can enjoy like our real house in Pattaya to be honest with you guys for this house is uh, the most favorite place of all time is the second floor because you can see the design that you have like a glass um, door that not door the glass uh, floor I would say because you can see all your family members downstairs through the glass window and the pool guys look really cool like super cool I love it the kids love it my family love it everybody loves the pool and uh, you can chill out outside as you can see like it's really nice um, design oh my father see he's topless with my mom they just like hanging out after breakfast have coffee and maybe they filming TikTok or YouTube short <laughs> I just kidding they don't use TikTok <laughs> Right now everybody have a quick change because we don't have time for shower otherwise the restaurant will be closed. So we are on the bad bus to the restaurant and um, it's really nice, uh, how do you say, like a really good transportation because it charged only like uh, 10 baht per person but for all our family here we just spent $5 for everybody to go to the restaurant so it's like around um, Mm, seven, five to seven kilometers from our house to the restaurant. So as you guys can see, here is the uh, where the register area because we didn't book before, and um, we just need to wait for our uh, ticket number to be called because uh, this is on the weekend and it's a lot of people, and we need to be patient if you want to eat the good food, right? Right now we already got our table and order after we wait for like um, 30 minutes or so I think 
And uh, the, the food, it might be not taking long because the staff said that it's only around between 10 to 15 minutes. That's good, even though they have a lot of people today. Um, yeah, if you see the kitchen here, they got like so many staff uh, cooking different kinds of food on different sections, so that's good. However, uh, we are walking now outside nearby the uh, restaurant because they have a lot of street uh, food vendors. They sell like a snack before our uh, food arrives and they're not really super strict by bringing those snack inside the restaurant. So that's good and let's get something. So right now I order the uh, grill dry squid for us. This is for 100 baht, just for three. And then they gonna grind it like this. This is like a really cool and a really nice, um, how to say, like technique how to grind it for uh, you to have like um, to be able to be like uh, super tender, like you can see. It's like a super cool, uh, unique technique how they uh, build it. And this is how it looks when it's when it's done. <laughs> Our food is almost arrived, but I'm looking to the menu to see if they have this crispy uh, fish because I see the other table order and it looks really good, smell really good, so I need to order that. And um, here is the Lin, her name is Lin, uh, old friend of Dan. Shout out to Lin, thank you so much for taking us to the place and taking care of our family. And um, you guys, if you are uh, wanted to see the menu, I will post in the uh, at the end of the video. And here's our food arriving now, and it looks really good, and it tastes good too. It's really, it's really yummy. You guys need to try this, and this is the local soup, papaya salad, super spicy. Yeah, this is the fish that I was talking about. Oh my god, this is so good. Even though the bone guy, it's so crispy, like, super crispy. You guys, here is the menu that you can take a look to the picture as well as the price and uh, what kind of food do they have. In case if you are traveling on the budget and um, I mentioned that it's cheap, but uh, for you it's not cheap, so it's not really like uh, kind of fair for uh, everyone to say that it's cheap because um, when I say it's cheap because of the quality and what we get, it's quite a reasonable price. Uh, because it's fresh and a uh, nice restaurant, very good service and everything. And um, normally, before we go for the uh, food at any restaurant, if we can see the food before we go, so it's kind of like give us the idea what kind of food. And uh, honestly, I would tell that the food is good or not. But sometimes the food is looks good, but it doesn't taste good. Well, sometime only, but mostly it can tell. Um, anyway, thank you so much, guy, for coming along with us uh, to this seafood restaurant and uh, see our uh, private pool villa uh, quick tour. And don't forget to give us um, like, comment, or subscribe. Um, but if you guys don't want to give us the uh, subscribe or comment, just give us a like that would be much appreciated um, honestly yeah and uh, next day we're gonna go to the uh, 1 million stone so they have like the uh, crocodile um, crocodile show and uh, we see a lot of uh, um, animal I mean zoo that we can uh, take the kids to see around so stay tuned for that and um, for now Thanks again guys for watching and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye for now. So three of this quite so three dry sweat dry sweat. <laughs> it's kind of like a little bit difficult word anyway. Okay.